off to first grade. Written by Louise Borden. Illustrated by Joan Rankin. Anna. At last, it is August 26th on our calendar. It's a big day. The day that I start first grade at Elm School. Mrs. Miller will be my teacher. At breakfast, I tell my little brother Ray about the zillions of books I will bring home to read to him. Ben, I look in the mirror in our bathroom, then I tuck in my shirt and I stand as tall as I can. Good luck, Mr. Handsome First Grader. My mom gives me a big off the first grade hug. Claire, my dad stands in our yard and holds up his camera. Say cheese. He calls to me and my brother CJ. CJ and I grin our best grins, but I don't say cheese. Instead I say, first grade. Click, goes the camera. D, the sun is up and the sky is blue. My mom says, it's perfect first grade weather. We wait and wait on the street corner for the big yellow school bus. At last, I hear a rum rum come up our street. We look at the number on the bus. It's number five. That's my bus. I hug my mom goodbye and I'm off to first grade. Eric, Felicia, and Gabby. All three of us are on bus 19. We are off to first grade and Mrs. Miller will be our teacher. Our bus makes seven more stops on the way to Elm School. On the bus, Eric tells us that Mrs. Miller is nice and that she puts on a black top hat during math class and does magic tricks with a handkerchief and dimes. Eric's sister was in Miss Miller's class last year so Eric knows all the important first grade stuff. A top hat! We will be math magicians! Henry I'm on bus 3 and I have a box of new markers and a box of new crayons in my backpack. My grandma says I'm the artist in the family. I have a huge paint box at home. A third grader sits next to me on bus 3. She says Mrs. Miller has clay and paper and brushes and paint in her classroom. I can't wait to be a first grade artist. Ignacio I am in a new country, America. My school is new to me too. My papa works in a new job. He says many people who are immigrants have come to America, just like us. Last week, we met Mrs. Miller, my teacher, and Mr. Zimmerman, my principal. They told me they could help me with my English. Today is my first day. I hold my papa's hand and practice my English. Elm School. Mrs. Miller. First grade. Josh. Kristen and Lee, we're on bus 9, and we will be first graders in Mrs. Miller's class. All three of us like sports. Our favorite sports are basketball and baseball. Hockey and lacrosse, football and swimming. Elm School is a new school for Lee. He went to kindergarten at another school. Kristen tells Lee, don't worry, you'll be like the kids at Elm School. Josh and I will be your first friends. We're on your team. Mrs. Miller. It's the first day of school. My classroom is all ready for my students. I have asked Mr. Zimmerman, our principal, to visit our classroom after lunch today. I told Mr. Zimmerman this will be my best class of readers yet. Last week I cut out 23 name tags. Snip, snip, snip. One for each first grader's desk. Today, just before my students arrive, I'll check those name tags one by one. I want to remember all 23 names. Nina, my house is a block from Elm School and today I'm off to first grade. My grandpa Pops lives in Chicago and he's here for a visit. So I ask him to walk me to school. My grandpa has gray hair and he likes to whistle songs. He tells me he can remember his first day in first grade 60 years ago. We figure out his age together. Wow! Pops is pretty old. When we get to the front doors of the school, I give Pops a hug. I tell my grandpa, 
I'll always remember my first day in first grade too. Otto, on the way to first grade at Elm School, I think about my grandma. On Saturday, she bought me new red sneakers, brand new. Not like those smelly hand-me-down sneakers from my brother. When grandma told me my red sneakers were just right for first grade, I told grandma she was just right for me. Polly, my mom hands me a shiny new penny to put in my pocket. For good luck in first grade. I hug her goodbye and walk to Elm School with my two big brothers. They hold my hand as we cross the street. I will show my penny to Mrs. Miller. She'll be my teacher this year. I keep my hand in my pocket, holding my penny, all the way to first grade. Quinn, my dad will take me to school today, just like he did last year when I was in kindergarten. We listen to jazz music on the radio in dad's car all the way to Elm School. The sun is too bright in my eyes, but I don't mind one little bit because the windows are down and I'm with my dad. And I'm rap tap tapping my feet to the beat. My dad says jazz is the best kind of music, that there isn't any other music like it. I wonder if Mrs. Miller likes jazz. I'll ask her today when I get to first grade. Ramon, Mrs. Miller's classroom is down a long hall, but there are two long halls in Elm School. Remember to turn right, not left, my sister Lucia tells me at the front doors of Elm School. Lucia is in fifth grade. Her classroom is upstairs. Lots of kids hurry past us. My sister gets a blue marker out of her backpack. She puts a big blue dot on my right hand, so I will turn right and not left. Lucia is the best sister in the world. Shelly. My mom and my sister Em walk me to school. I push Em in her stroller and hum a little song for her. I call it Em's song. At the front door of Elm School, I tell Em she is too little to go with me to first grade. Then I kiss her and hug my mom and say goodbye three times. I hum M song all the way down the long hall to Mrs. Miller's classroom. Theo, Umberto, and Victoria. We're neighbors, so we will walk to Elm School together. On the way, we stop and check our lunch boxes. We lift the lids and peek inside. Theo has a tuna sandwich and Umberto has ham. Victoria's lunch will be a banana, a peanut butter sandwich, and her very favorite dessert, animal crackers. Yum, yum. Wit, I wonder if Mrs. Miller is as nice as my kindergarten teacher. I wonder if I will get to work at a computer. I wonder if I'll get to write with chalk on the big blackboard. I wonder if I will learn to read the words in our first grade books. I wonder how I will know which desk is my desk. Xavier, I drive bus six and I tell all the students on my bus to call me by my first name, Xavier. I tell kids I'm like Superman. I have x-ray vision on my bus. I can see monkey business before it even happens. The first day of school is always terrific. It's a new beginning for all of us. Yoshi, today is the first day of first grade. I wish I was going back to kindergarten, but I don't tell my dad. On the way to Elm School, I tell my dad I think first grade should start tomorrow, not today. My dad says, okay. I'll ask Mr. Zimmerman if you can go to second grade today and start first grade tomorrow. I tell my dad maybe today is a good day to start first grade. Mr. Zimmerman, I'm the principal at Elm School and I'm the luckiest person in the world. I talk with parents, I read books to kids, I play football with the students at recess. Today everyone at Elm School gets an A+. We're all ready to begin the best school year ever. Hmm, which book would be just right to read to Mrs. Miller's class after lunch?